All right, Al Soto, click on this. And of course, my co-host will click on this. Also, the star yeah. of Massey. I don't know about that. <laughs> Big screening here tonight at the Charles Theater. Yes. And uh, you're a new stranger to the Charles Theater. You have quite a few premieres here, haven't you? I've had several premieres yeah. here. I love this theater. I've seen it change. You know, um, Baltimore's great. I've seen, I've seen the, the renaissance here in town. And, uh, you know, I'm a hometown boy, so it's been, it's been great. And I love the Charles Theater. I mean, tonight's Massey premiere was very awesome. Yeah. Now, uh, how would you say you, this character that you portrayed, Jack, yeah. is different than a lot of the other work that you've done? Well, you know, I'm very stereotyped with the rock and roll character. You know, the bad boy, the second in command. <laughs> this one was um, still kind of the same. Very loner-ish. Very, um, you know, anti-social. Uh, does a lot of things that are kind of underground and trouble. But he was the forefront guy. So he's kind of like the, the Lonely Hearts lead. You know, it's like the, the bleeding heart leads. So I, I, that was one of the reasons why I took the character. Not only that, I mean, I shot the movie for almost 50 days in York, and I got to shoot pool for 50 days. So I got pretty good. I actually got really good. And I mean, I have all my boys from APA. These guys really taught me a lot of stuff. A lot yeah, of stuff. Well, the title of the film is Massé. Did yes. you master the Massé? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. No, no. I mean, we had. I had a lot of. I had a lot of training. I had a lot of. Um, I had a lot of coaching, and I mean, everyone was great. I mean, we, some some nights we were on set, and we would shoot until about two, three, four in the morning. So of course I'd be trying to mass a shot, and you know, I mean, you have to be a skilled player. It's not easy to do that. I mean, I got around a little bit, you know, a little bit. But I mean, to be to be frank, no. I. Whatever you see in the film, there's a lot of there's a lot of post production, but I mean, but the stuff that I, you see me shooting, I actually did make. So. You gotta give me some credit. Uh, well, I thought you play like a pro, Pi. Yeah, I mean, man. come on now. Come on, man. Like I said, 50 Days in New York, man. You know, yeah. it, was, it was a blast. And um, working with Bad Fair Films was just seriously a great time. It wasn't just working for a company, it was working for like family. And you know, they housed me at the Yorktown Hotel, which reminds me of the Belvedere Hotel that we have down here in Baltimore. And uh, Jay and Courtney were just, they were the best hosts and uh, great script, great producing, great directing. And uh, I couldn't ask for more. And uh, I gotta say, uh, some great fight scenes in this film, and uh, certainly showing your badass side for, for, for <laughs> especially against guys twice your size. Bob. Twice my size, three times my size, about four times my weight. You know, I mean, seriously, muscle mass is unbelievable. But yet, I'm kicking their ass. You should see this movie. I look like a like a Bruce Lee stud. It's so awesome. No, I had a blast, and um, I learned a lot. I learned from uh, Master Vince. He, this guy was so good with teaching me. His guys were great. Everyone was like just so attuned, and um, we were very careful with each other. But we needed to make it look real. So there were there were some punches, there were some jabs, and I mean there was yeah there, there was there was, um, but only for them, not for me, because I'm the lead actor. <laughs> totally joking, totally joking. And from the fighting, we go into uh, I guess the the more naughty side of pie, and oh, yeah. and it's good to see with your clothes on. Thank you. <laughs> thanks, thanks for coming with your clothes. Well, on. I was thinking of doing this interview <laughs> nude, but I mean other than that, no, no, no. It was that you know. How was that? Through, how's it doing that scene? I mean, let, seriously. Let me tell you, man. It is not easy. Everybody says, "Oh my God, I want to be booked in a film because I get to make out with somebody." Let me tell you something. It's not that simple. First of all, you got 35 people walking around you. You know, eating tasty cakes and drinking tea while you're like taking clothes off. It's really not that fun. You're really like in a spotlight. So you have to be very in tune with the actor, you know, that you're working with and your director and your producers. And just know that it's a tight set and it's a closed set and that everybody is going to be professionally cool. You know, um, some of those scenes, man, I mean, we shot like maybe 14, 15 hours. <laughs> yeah, believe me, man. I mean, it was. I've never lasted that long in bed. I can tell you right now. Yeah, I can tell you that. You know, my girlfriend will attest to this, but I'm telling you, dude, no. okay. it was, um, it was, it was, like I said, it was an experience. Right. And I mean, when Jay and Courtney signed me onto the project, they told me how graphic this is going to be. And, you know, am I, am I willing to do this? And, you know, as an actor, you're a sponge. As an actor, you're supposed to do whatever you are given and do it to the best and the fullest capacity that you've got. And, you know, yeah, I mean, it turned out well. You saw it. It, it looked all right, you know? And you enjoyed working with Barbara. Oh, of course. <laughs> Who wouldn't be? Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? Come on. No, but I mean, I had a blast, and um, 
it's just another thing that I can add to my resume, you know? I mean, sure. as an actor, like I said, you're a sponge, and you're supposed to soak everything up and do it. I mean, you guys had that on-screen chemistry. Yeah, not, not just the, the, the love scenes, but... No, but sense. in general, yeah, of course. I mean, you know, it's, it's acting, but at the same time, if you really enjoy your, your co-star, then it, it even looks better, you know? Yeah. So, you know, we, we enjoyed our company, and like I said, it was a great reunion with everybody being here tonight. I've got my, I've got my fighters, I've got, you know, I've got Barb, I've got, you know, um, Barry, Jonathan, everybody's here, so um, it's been great. Well, tremendous job. Thank you. Johnny, uh, I mean, definitely one of your most stellar uh, pieces of work, I, I must say. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, yeah, I'm not just the rock and roll asshole. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> right it's been good. It's been good. Right on. <laughs> All right. Well, cool. Well, hey, uh, lots more to come, and uh, we have an after party, uh, a couple a couple yeah. drinks that we have to... <laughs> Anyways. A couple drinks. <laughs> yes. And more to come here. Click on this. Click on this.